Baseball has truly become an international game, and two mid-pack students are using the sport to make an impact. Kyler and Carter Agon are collecting new and used sports equipment and donating it to those in need half a world away. Jim Mendoza has their story. Kyler and Carter Agon have grown up playing sports. When the brothers aren't tossing a ball around, they're playing baseball for Mid-Pacific Institute, but they do something else that isn't found in a box score. So we collect uh, lightly used or unused uh, baseball equipment and give them to underprivileged people around the Pacific Rim. It started with a pair of cleats that Carter was going to get rid of. Kyler said, why not donate them to a young athlete who couldn't afford shoes? Then they asked others to chip in. We got helmets, bats, shoes, gloves, baseballs. So you got just like any kind of uh, baseball equipment. With the help of Senator Glenn Wakai, they shipped the gear to Palau, along with goods Wakai had collected in a donation drive. What? Now the Agons have a bigger goal. They're on a campaign to collect We're lightly used or new sporting equipment to help more athletes throughout Micronesia. People in the Pacific Rim, they, they have like a hard time getting that stuff because they're like very poor. So that's why donating stuff is pretty important for them. The brothers are so serious about their plans, they founded a nonprofit called the Kinipopo Ho Foundation, and they've gotten the support of BusyKit, the popular app that teaches youth useful tools for managing money. This is a perfect example of a couple of kids who have figured out that the world is bigger than they are. The Agons have used BusyKid to learn the value of earning, saving, and sharing. Their foundation is now listed among the charities the app's subscribers can make financial donations to, and it's a big playing field. We've got over 130,000 people on the app now and, uh, and growing every day. Carter and Kyler operate their foundation on a simple principle, give away old sporting equipment that still has life to give. And if you want to contribute something new, they'll take that too. Uh, it helps me feel good because not only do I get to help others, uh, who aren't able to afford the same equipment that uh, I'm able to get, but I'm able to help them continue to enjoy playing uh, baseball. They are baseball players, but they'll also accept equipment from other sports. So if you're planning to get rid of yours, the Agons will repurpose it instead, and they've made it easy to get involved. So they can donate to us by either dropping it off at Hawaiian Hardball, or they can go to our website, which is kinipopoho.com, and you can contact us there. And if you can't get your equipment to Hawaiian Hardball, we can come and pick it up for you. To borrow a baseball saying, these brothers have covered all the bases. I'm Jim Mendoza for Hawaii News Now. That is some awesome, awesome work right there. Yeah. And you know, the baseball community is so big in Hawaii, and it's so great to see them giving back. Absolutely. Good job, boys. Yeah. Well, thanks for